So, point again where you feel it. Here. Right there. Yeah. I'm going to do a pelvic jack here. Okay. I do see like a mild swelling right here, mm -hmm. and that's where you're saying it yeah. hurts. Okay, so you can hold, you can reach out for stability if you want, but just raise this knee up for me. Yep, and then down, and then this one up. No, what cracked? Knee? <laughs> My ankle. Ankle, okay. And then one more time for me. And down, and then this one. Good. Um. One more time. Right there. Okay, down. I feel it on the front. I know. My hip. That's why I'm grabbing yeah. it here this time. I do oh. have hip hip problems, so. And then down. A little less stability when you raise this right leg mm -hmm. up, which is common. It's okay. It's just, um, it means I have to work on both sides. So what happened to the hip then? I danced for like nine years. Okay. And ever since I started dancing, I would just get really bad hip problems. I, I've gone to... On your back face up for me. I've gone to go get checked, and they said I've had inflamed hips. Snapping hips from yeah, yeah, but it, it pops a lot. Any pain when I do this? No. Nothing? You want to cross it? It might pop. It just feels, yeah, it just feels like it needs to pop. Like it's, it hurts a little bit there? Yeah. Where does it hurt? Like right here. Right in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Scoot down to the edge of the table for me, and let me meet your... Uh, legs dangle just to there okay now grab this knee up to your chest and hug it okay does it hurt when I press this down no okay her thigh hits the table there a little bit of restriction in the hip not bad though okay mm -hmm. um, all right go ahead and scoop back up and feel your neck and then you're just gonna lift both feet off of the ground here and hold it just lift your legs so you're just gonna go straight for me, just okay. straight up. Yep, right to, just to there, just to there. Any pain when you do that? No, just like pinching in my lower back. Lower back, mm -hmm. okay. I'm gonna place my hand right here, okay, and I'm gonna raise your hand, your leg up. Any pain when I do this? No. Go a little further? No? Mm -mm. Doesn't recreate the pinching at all? No. I'm gonna place both of my hands right here on your hip bones, okay? okay. Just in the front right here. Any pain when I do that? No. Nothing in the back? No. Relax. There you go. There's all that scar tissue down there on the left hand yeah. side. I feel it. That's the one right there. Ready for the adjustment? Yes. It's it needs it really badly right here, <laughs> okay? Take a deep breath in. Let it go. Perfect. Breathe. I need that. <laughs> yeah, really, really badly. Come back, let's get it. This one should be easy. Yeah. Breathe. Perfect. Excellent adjustment. I'm gonna really go for this one, okay? Okay. That's it. Very good. That should feel better. <laughs> <laughs> now we've pushed it back in, okay? Good. Ooh. Stuck. Back away a little bit. I got you. I got you. Oh, no. perfect. That was stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Bend your knee for me. There it goes. Perfect. Well, 
that's when I kind of felt. You heard it? Yeah. It hurts there, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, so your iliopsoas muscle is a little tight here. Okay. okay. So when I do this, I'm mm -hmm. pinching it. I'm okay. pinching it when I do that. Yeah, that's, that's how it feels. Yeah, so like, that's why when I had, but it's not contracted, it's not um, spasming. What we really, what will help it is to work on the quads, actually, which is a... When did this happen to you? Like a, long, like a couple of years ago, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah, this is, nobody's rehabbed her hip, or she doesn't know how to re continually rehab it. And this is what you gotta do. It sucks. <laughs> she just had it done. <laughs> so she's like, I feel so sorry for you. <laughs> do you need to bite down on something? No. It like tickles but hurts. See right there, same spot you have. Same spot. Because it's so common. I can just mm -hmm. place a bet. And <laughs> you know, you're not the only ones yeah. that have it. Anytime you injure your hip, it's a natural response to injury for this to happen. And it snaps and it clicks and it yeah. we call it snapping hip syndrome. <laughs> really intelligent name. <laughs> it's just the iliopsoas is kind of the tendons here. Are rolling over the bone and they make a snap. Yeah, it does a lot. Hurts. So we try to push that, we try to take some slack off of the tendon so mm -hmm. it stops snapping over that bone. It's snapping over the bone because it's pulled tight. Mm -hmm. It's pulled tight and it snaps over the bone. If we can oh. relax it, mm -hmm. it won't snap because it's not being pulled tight. It does make sense. So it'll hurt less if I release this knot. Yeah. I'm a miracle worker. No, you can, you can do it yourself. You know, just get a foam roller and get it. Tennis ball or something, you know, just. Yeah, I wouldn't, I'd probably give up at it once it started hurting. No, no, no. <laughs> well, you don't want to mush it to a pulp. Ten passes is usually what I tell people. Like, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, you do ten. Okay. The first time, what I just did is the worst. <laughs> After about a week of doing it, you're like, I don't think I need to do this anymore. No, you still need to check on it mm -hmm. once in a while, okay? okay? Now watch, here we go. It's not gonna take it all away, but it'll take some of it. Yeah. See how that mm -hmm. takes that away. I don't really feel I'm like a miracle worker. <laughs> no, it's just all I did was just took the slack off, so it's okay. not snapping. Or getting pinched. Okay. Okay. That's all we have to do. Okay. That lesson has been learned. <laughs> Let's move on. <laughs> How's it feel? How's the hip feel? A little better. It's good. See, all I did was release mm -hmm. a couple knots there. That's all I did. You would, I wouldn't think that I had knots there either. I mean, because it didn't. This didn't hurt. Right, but sometimes where it hurts isn't the place you're the supposed book, to work yeah. on. That makes sense. You go a little bit further away or more distal or more proximal. Okay. Often the part that's being injured is the part that you need to leave alone and let it heal. Okay. Sometimes. Yeah. A lot of the time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Except for like your neck up at the right. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. We just have to <laughs> pop that one. <laughs> there you go. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it just looks tight. Oh, that was a freebie. Maybe we should just go ahead and adjust this. <laughs> Take a deep breath in. Oh. Okay, and again. Okay. Upper, we're going to do those shoulders, okay? Okay. I don't know whether they're going to go. Okay. I just have no way of knowing. Deep breath in. Oh yeah, when it goes like that, it's the miracle adjustment <laughs> for a miracle of the day. <laughs> I needed those miracles. Aww. <laughs> and this one's a little sideways here, so take a deep breath in. There we go. Oh, very good. It kind of went in all by itself. And again. <sighs> That's all it goes. Okay. Now massage, okay? okay? Back to that. Back to that thing again. <laughs> okay, here we 
to go. <gasps> Crunchiness. Just inflammation. Okay. You're all right. It's a little bit of scar tissue from overuse. Hear it? Mm-hmm. You have to decrease this kyphosis here. You're a little bit kyphotic or rounded. Okay. Right. Um, lift your feet up for me real quick. And down. Tuck your chin for me. Here we go. Here was with the neck, okay? <gasps> side. Mm. Oh wow. It's just right here. Keep breathing for me. There it goes. Very good. Both arms behind your back for me. Double whammy here. I'm gonna bounce. Push, take a deep breath in, and look up for me, look up and down. Is this too much? You okay? Yeah, okay. Okay, maybe a little break. Got a little problem on this side. Oh, on your left. There's nothing on the right. Relax the right. I'm gonna work on the left here. Okay, here we go. Let's release this tendon. Now, understand you're gonna be super loose for the next week, okay? <laughs> okay. So no new exercises. Okay. Just work with what you got. You're gonna be super flexible. <laughs> That's what happened to you. You went and did Taekwondo, and then <laughs> Linda hit went and did Taekwondo, and then it kind of was like, oh, my hip. Um, I'm like, well, yeah, you're super flexible, mm -hmm. and then just it delays the recovery time. It's not a permanent injury, but it messes you up a little bit. Messes you up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> So take it easy for about a week, okay? okay. I don't mean don't do any exercise. Right. Just nothing new that you okay. wouldn't normally do, okay? All right. I'm going to do 10 reps now. <laughs> Look at all this flexibility. Mm -hmm. I have so much more torque. Wow. You know, no, don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't rely on that for about a week, okay? Then go ahead and have fun and do whatever. And there it goes. Okay, relax. Whew. I never knew that there was something there. Here's the scraping, okay? Okay. How's it feel? Does it feel okay? Yeah, it feels good, actually. You like it sideways like that? It's the best I can do. You can fix it now. Yeah, I know. It's all teeth. 
to you how you like it. It don't matter. It can be sideways. See, there's the last of that crunchiness there. Say hello, say goodbye. To get rid of these crunchies. This is what gets rid of the crunchies. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty much the only thing I can do. I can massage it with my hand. Mm -hmm. It won't go away. Yeah, I... This, see? I can really pick at that. Yeah. And get rid of that for you. Okay, tuck your chin for me. That's all I'm gonna do on the upper back. Now we got the rest of the back to do, okay? <laughs> and the legs. I am going to roll this down, okay? okay. Just to here. Okay. I can only get one. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna press down here, okay? Does it feel okay? I just feel like a little bit where I was telling you. Where? Like, right here? Like where start I to get hurt. That pain a little bit. Okay. Since the pants are kind of high, I'm going to do it with the roller. Do the good side first. Is that okay? Yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah. You're like, yeah. <laughs> Let me just fix it here. It's almost yeah. where the ischial tuberosity is. That needs to be released. Okay, hamstring. All right, hamstring. Again. Yeah. You let me know, mm -hmm. but I really do need to work right here. Okay. Hey, here's the lower back. Looks, feel that? Mm -hmm. oh, that's good. Getting some of that out of there. Mm. Yeah, see, I don't know if it's your sacrum. <coughs> I'm thinking it's referred pain, you know, it's radiating pain into your sacrum from here. So that's awfully swollen. When I did the knee raises and stuff, mm -hmm. I couldn't find any thing shocking so my bet is it's from here it's really bad right here five four three two one breathe and here we go again good
gotta get right here. Is that okay? Yeah. Is it okay. But you have a knot right here, mm -hmm. and it's right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, there, there we go. Perfect. Okay. Definitely not as swollen here. Okay. But still. I'm not gonna get that with the scraper. I hate cold. You gotta fill it all in. Must fill it all in. <laughs> I'm so excited to see what it looks like. Okay, we'll show you. Now, you have to keep in mind, it's pink. Okay, so the pink will go away. Okay. The purple is what stays for about seven days, okay? okay. Tell me if I missed anything. Like how your shoulders feel, especially. I feel, I can actually press them for once. <laughs> I hope so. I dug my dang elbow in there. It feels good. It feels good. Like, it was really, really tight. Like, it was bad. But now I feel... It feels better? Yeah. All right, come on in and like sit I can down. Move. Well, I kind of figured it would be a lot up there. Yeah, I don't know if we have another one, but your neck had some. Pretty yeah, that's right where ones. it hurts a lot, too. Like, where my headaches come from, I feel. Hmm. Okay. That's cool. That'll go away completely in seven days. You won't okay. even know you've had it done. <laughs> My elbow. Oh. Okay. You gotta really <laughs> lock that <laughs> lat down. Right here, into your elbow. No. Nope. I like I am. It might be a little weak. Go, 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 as hard as you can. Right here. Press, 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 press. That's it. Okay. That's all it goes. Okay. Yeah, I have to feel it click in. Like that's end range. Mm -hmm. Doesn't go past that. So as soon as I feel a shoulder click in, we don't go. If mm -hmm. it pops, it pops. It doesn't. It doesn't. But I want it to <laughs> go all the way in. <laughs> okay. We tend to, as we slouch, our shoulders come forward. Okay. So I'm pushing them back. I don't pop them this way. Mm -hmm. Bright green. We just did a green theme, too. I think I've watched it. Clean away. Good. It was a little congested there. I felt that in my wrist. Like yeah, I was... Tightness. Yeah, oh. you feel it there? Yeah, yeah lean away. It's moving now. It just might be from you typing or writing. Oh. You said yeah. you write a lot. Mm -hmm. You know, having your wrist propped like that, well, or bent like that. I do well. pop it a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's kind of jamming that spot. So you need to you, you need to open that up. You're constantly, look, you're constantly going like that. So it just feels swollen here. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying to go the other way. Okay, pull that open. People are like, look, I can pop it. And I'm like, I know, but <laughs> I, just I want it my work. work. Yeah, it gives you some relief. Yeah, but that that's opening. See the little how it. Mm -hmm. Forms a little divot right there. Okay. When you go like this, you're jamming. Okay. Hmm. I mean, you're opening this side. Right. But then you're jamming that side. So just make sure you're also taking some time and going the other way. 
carefully. <laughs> it won't pop the other way. Oh. Just, just stretch open. It. Just stretch it and go the other way. Because okay. that might be why you're feeling it, and the only way you know how to pop it is that way. Yeah. But understand that you're opening one side of the wrist and you're jamming the other. Okay. So make sure you just pull it. You just do this, see? Okay. See how, here's my normal wrist. See how I'm pulling the bones apart right here? Mm hmm See, here's together. Open. Okay. okay, that's all you need to be doing. I'm probably feel more better anyway. Okay, you're just kind of getting blood mm -hmm. in there. Okay. <laughs> what, is, what is it from? Like, what is all this tightness and stuff from? Okay, so what this is from is from leaning forward. You're very what we call kyphosed. So okay. you work long hours, mm -hmm. what? Leaning um, forward. Yeah. I mean, have somebody take a picture of you while you work. Okay. And you'll notice that you're probably doing one of these and you're into the, you're into what, or you're writing or you're doing something where you're forward. Well, it's funny because one of my coworkers, I was telling her about like how much it hurts and she was like, you lean forward at your desk all day. Right. And I was like, right. Yeah. So the way that you take pressure off it is to do this. I'm going to give you a stretch one stretch, the mighty stretch, and you're going to okay. do that every day. Okay. That will take about 50% of it away all by okay. itself. Okay, let's open up the chest, both arms behind you, and look up and away so I don't hit you in the face. I'm working on this pec here, okay? okay. So I come in here and like try to open this up for you before the mighty stretch, okay? That's everything <laughs> you can do to not scream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm done, done. And I just don't want to hit you, so like up and back. Your neck should feel good by now, and you should be able to do it. it we wait for the end to do this. Just right down that back. I'm having a hard time. Just lean, look back for me a little bit, like just to tilt your head back, so I don't whack you. My <laughs> my scraper's too long here. Yeah, I want to hit your throat. <laughs> Flint. <laughs> we don't want to do that. There it is. An actual real knife. It's not. I, I, I know, really. <laughs> we'll have to cut that out. <laughs> it's not a knife. It's dull. It's dull. Ooh, that's what was worse. Look, now you can look at it. Right there. Mm. Okay. It felt worse. Yeah, as soon as we worked on it, it was mm -hmm. like, oh. So... I don't, I couldn't tell you, maybe you're reaching around more with this arm. Mm. Maybe you're sleeping on that arm. You know, there's something where you're compressing mm -hmm. the front over there. Okay. Oh my goodness. I thought I got most of it when you were mm -hmm. on your stomach, but I gotta like grip you in a bite. <laughs> <laughs> a headlock here. Yeah, I have to tell people a lot, like, use your elbow because whenever they just try to, like, massage it, I don't really feel it that much. Well, it, do you, now if you stand up straight, now feel the muscle. Feel the muscle, how it's different. Mm -hmm. Now slouch again like you were. Okay. Do you feel the difference? Mm -hmm. Okay, you're taking the tension off of your, this right here, your upper traps mm -hmm. when you're backwards. I'm leaning with almost everything I've got on you. And she's not leaning away. <laughs> <laughs> she's leaning back into me. <laughs> I'm like, whoa. Because it hurts, but it feels so good to finally get some type of relief. Oh. There it goes. Ugh. Okay. Okay, I'm going to take care of the good side first. Now we're going to do this. Perfect. Awesome. here on the sore spot, okay? Just try to let the energy leave your shoulder there. It's pretty, you just carry a lot of tension, okay?
that stress of the day comes mm-hmm. back into your body, you're, it's just going to tighten back up again. So the only thing that we can do to combat that and how we combat that is to undo what you've done. Okay. And stretching the front part of your fascia. Okay. Okay. Um, most people just roll on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but look, watch this. Raise your hands above your um, head. All that you'll get you an even deeper stretch. Okay, this is how you take the tension off of that. It doesn't make any sense, does it? But, but I feel it. I in like in the center of my back, I feel like it needs to pop so much a lot. Right. Because the joints are separated. So you're trying to close them by mm-hmm. popping them. But it's just a brief moment. If you want to continue to hold pressure on it like you're doing right now it mm-hmm. won't feel that need anymore oh, okay that was nice okay so easy that's it i feel a lot better like hopefully i'm uh, getting this on camera my camera girl just left <laughs> she like ditched me <laughs> <laughs> does it feel like better I, yeah i just feel like i'm not tight like i feel like i can move like my neck feels a lot better and right here well, they moved. And like, we, we got them. Whenever I was coming in, I was starting to get a headache and I just felt it coming up. But now it's like gone. This feels like 500 times better too. You can massage the muscle all day when it's round and forward like this. Mm-hmm. Okay, I can just be like this and I can just. <laughs> it still hurts. Right. Right, you have to be back. You have to be back and take the tension, the slack out of the structure. So whenever I stand, am I standing? You're, you're fine now, yeah. <laughs> now? <laughs> yeah, you look good right now. <laughs>